Welcome to the Technique Stadium, everybody. Good afternoon. This afternoon's Manorama National League game is between Chesterfield and Bromley. And before the kickoff, we've got a, a tribute to pay now to former Chesterfield manager John Duncan, a legend here at Chesterfield Football Club. He uh, achieved a lot here. He uh, won two promotions with the Spirats in 1985 and again in 1995, and also that memorable season in 1997 when the Spirats went all the way to the uh, FA Cup semi-final, just one match away from the Cup final. John Duncan, who's who played for Dundee and in the top division, in the Division 1 with Spurs, also managed Scunthorpe United and Hartlepool before going to Chesterfield, and then went on to manage Ipswich Town as well, before coming back to Chesterfield when they were at Saltergate. Dobber, it's Banks plays it out wide, a chance here, Old Aker now, Shimanga arriving in the penalty area, Mandeville also, Old Aker plays it into Dobra. Dobra tries the shot, it's blocked first time, blocked at source there by Dobra. it will be a corner, the first corner of the game goes to the Spyrites. Holly Banks, King, Jeff King tried the shot on the left foot and saved by Smith in the Bromley goal. First shot on target for either side comes from Jeff King of Chesterfield. Banks. That's a good ball. King inside the area. Jeff King still. King with the shot, and King with the goal! A well-worked goal by Jeff King, who gets his fourth goal of the season, and the Spyrites are in front. It's Chesterfield 1, Bromley 0. Shimanga, it's Mandeville on the ball now, Liam Mandeville striding forward, Shimanga, the referee plays the advantage, Shimanga's got Oldacre in support, the cross goes in, Dobra missed it, and Banks put it out, great opportunity to increase their lead straight away there, Dobra and Banks both missed it in the end, but again a good flowing move by Chesterfield, Hannum is further forward, so too is Whiteley, the ball goes to Reese Hannum, High ball there, cheek waiting for it to come to Corey Whiteley, who's had a shot straight away. Not a bad effort from Corey Whiteley, but straight at the goalkeeper. It's Hannum getting the ball away. Ball Bromley, and now Michael Cheek is Bromley trying to break here. Cheek on the ball, Marriott's up there with him as well. This is Adam Marriott now. The ball goes out to Whiteley. Whiteley lifts the high ball into the area, and Fitzsimons takes it right on his line as Marriott came in. Bromley breaking quickly there, and that's what Chesterfield have got to be careful of. The experienced Brian Byron Webster, who's 35 now. 
lot of uh, bodies in the six yard box. It's Marriott flicks the ball over the top, and the header is into the arms of Ross Fitzsimons, who is in exactly the right place. But uh, Horton's throw, headed on by Oldacre. Shimanga. It's a good ball from Shimanga to Banks. King in space on the right. Spotted by Banks. That's the ball. King with the first time cross. It's hit low into the area. And Mandeville had the shot. It was deflected and out for a corner kick. Good move again by the Spyrites. Brandon Horton. Dobra. Old Acre. Gets around the challenger. Bennings tried the shot. Just wide. The referee singles the goal kick, but a good effort there from Darren Old Acre. Almost putting the Blues 2 0 up. Corey Whiteley on the ball now for Bromley. It's three on three here at the moment. It's still Whiteley taking on Mike Jones. Jones goes with him now. Whiteley's in the air. He pulls it back nicely for Adam Marriott. And Marriott scores. Chesterfield on the back foot all the way there. And the top scorer, Adam Marriott, scores his seventh goal of the season for Bromley and levels it here at the Technique Stadium. It's Chesterfield one, Bromley one. Webster plays it back to his goalkeeper who's outside his penalty area. King with the header for Chesterfield. Banks. Only Banks doing well there as Reynolds stays down. Mandeville, the ball into Shimanga. Shimanga slots that one through. Great chance for King. And fired in by Shimanga and still the ball's alive. It's out. Darren Oldacre on it now. Lays it off to Brandon Horton. And Horton puts it over the bar. Dobra was so close to finishing it, Horton was so close to finishing it and the Bromley players not happy that the referee allowed play to continue. Dobra, it's a nice ball, Horton pulls it low into the area, chance for Mandeville, lays it back to Dobra, Amando Dobra in once more, headed away by Webster. Jeff King on it now. Reynolds keeping him out of the penalty area at the moment. King with the crossing with the left foot and the header in the back of the net from Oli Banks. Oli Banks give the Spurs the lead once more. Well worked move by Chesterfield that looked like it was going to fizzle out for a moment. But when that ball came in again, it was Ollie Banks there with his head. You don't see that many heady goals from Ollie Banks. But he's sure he's happy with that one as Chesterfield retake the lead in the game here. It's Chesterfield 2, Bromley 1, Ollie Banks on 61 minutes. Dobra. Rob Bennings there, Amando Dobra, can he go all the way? Dobra shot! Just wide of the goal from Amando Dobra. Great determination there from the little Albanian because he robbed Bennings straight away on the edge of the area. And Amando Dobra just wide of the goal. Had a forward by Oldacre. Clayton losing out there to Banks. Molly Banks forced to back Trafford because of Vennings, but he, Chesterfield get it forward again now. This is Mandeville, plays it out wide to King, in towards Shimanga. King goes down, and the penalty is given by Danny Middleton. The challenge by Webster, I think it was, Byron Webster, 
Jeff King inside the area and Danny Middleton pointing straight to the spot. And Shimanga now with a chance to take this penalty after Bromley have delayed it as much as they can. It's Shimanga versus Tom Smith. Yeah! And Shimanga fires it home. Kabongo Shimanga with the goal on 73 minutes. It's Shimanga's fifth goal of the season, but I think it's his first goal from his first start of the season. So Shimanga's penalty gives Chesterfield now a fairly commanding lead as we enter the 74th minute. It's Chesterfield three, Bromley one. Keeping Bromley on the back foot as much as you can. And uh, Chesterfield attempting to do that now as Shimanga gets pulled around there by Webster. Banks. Mandeville. Bush trying to make the clearance there. And the Bromley player down right in front of the bench there. And the referee, Danny Middleton. Has booked Ollie Banks, who's not very happy about it. And there the Chesterfield bench. Paul Cook there, just on the halfway line, encroaching onto the Bromley area. He's having a, a word, I think, with Andy Woodman as well there. The two managers together there. And the game will restart with um, a Bromley free kick. of play, Bromley throw taken quickly by Coleman, Forster, Grimes couldn't block it, he's all the way through, oh and he's in the back of the net from Marriott, for the second time, Fitzsimons couldn't keep it out, Williams almost put it in his own net in an attempt to clear, and it was Marriott that headed it over, headed it over the line, for his second goal of the game. So Tom Smith with the goal kick for Bromley. Grimes up there for the header against Coleman. Bush. The high ball, Williams to deal with it. It's a high header from Williams, he's got to go again. Vennings plays it wide. Clayton out on that far side, plays it back. Vennings once more, Vennings with the shot! And not very far over the crossbar of Ross Fitzsimons from uh, James Vennings there. As Bromley get more and more desperate to try and find this equaliser now. We've got six, just over six minutes of the 90 remaining. A straight strike on goal from Wiley. And over the crossbar. Much to the relief of the Chesterfield defence. So a bonus here for Bromley, the corner here they weren't expecting. Vennings to take it. it. Goes all the way through and out of play, this time for a goal kick. Cheek. Gets the cross into the box. Oh, saved on the line by Fitzgerald and then headed away by King. Harry Forster denied the equalising goal there. They do have a corner kick, though. And Bromley will keep the pressure on from that. The seven minutes are now up. Chesterfield, it's concentration time. Back out in the defence. Vennings, Forster. Harry Forster cuts inside, plays the ball into the area. It's away by Grimes. Bush. Shimanga and Coleman go in there together. Shimanga, he could have played it through there to Whelan. That's down the line for Cooper. George Cooper now. Banks arriving in the area. Shimanga two, Whelan two. Cooper with the shot. And well saved there by the goalkeeper, Tom Smith. George Cooper went direct on goal. And the referee blows the final whistle here. 
at the Chinese Stadium this afternoon.